Welcome to a special edition of Stand Up and Speak Up with Werner Berger and Deborah Morrison and me. This is going to be exciting as I spend a few minutes with my favorite climbers. We're going to actually bring her in because I, I have her on the show and she was telling me about when you guys went up to Kilimanjaro and she, she wasn't going to do it. So Deborah, are you on the line? I am. I am. Well, there's two phases to this. One, we met at a WPN, you know, well, Warner and I have known each other for a long time. And we were at a WPN event. And during a break, Warner says to me, hey, Deborah, why don't you join me on Mount Kelly uh, climb? And I said, hey, Warner, why not? You know, and I got back to my table and I thought, what in the heck did you just say? Well, then, of course, I I grew into it and I love the uh, preparation and everything. But when I got there, I got so sick. And it's about trust in Werner. And I said to him, um, I had bad water, and, and so I was just like, you know, was, I was depleted. And I said to him, listen, um, I'm not sure I can do this. And he said, boy, that's totally up to you. And so we made an agreement, and uh, I said, you know, I can, I, just, I can go, I'll go, if I can be the first person after the professional guide. And when his boot comes up, his heel comes up, my toe of my boot goes in there, because I can't, so sick, I can't even think about where to place my foot. And so for two days, I just said, boot 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 didn't I Warner it was crazy but you were really the glue you just gave me the confidence all right I'll give you that grant you're right behind the guide but a bing but a bang and here we went and I was just mesmerized by your courage mm. and you know I'm just so thrilled right you could probably hear it in my voice to have somebody like you on a trip that's the hero within you and you probably don't see that as heroic but externally we see that how you don't mm. give up as long as you can keep going and know that you're going to be okay, you don't give up. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's yeah. personal power. Well, she no, became a hero to us when we heard that story because she was telling me, and I, and I read this too, about um, you had called it climber step and then rest step. Take a step and then a split mm -hmm. second of relaxation and step a moment. And I, I could visualize you, Deborah, you know, taking your step and then taking a step. And then, but in between... You kind of have to take that little pause and, and get your balance and whatever. But isn't that what life is all about? Is just taking a step and then mm -hmm. assessing? Mm -hmm. And taking mm -hmm. another step and not, not turning around, not going backwards, but just mm -hmm. moving forward. Yeah. So I mean, Warner, everybody was just commenting like, boot, boot, boot. It was just crazy because, I, you know, it was just, I, just, I was not in any physical condition to do anything else. It was reduced to that. <laughs> but that chant itself was motivation yeah, yeah and sometimes sure. maybe we need those mantras as motivating you know mindless things mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i don't know uh, i suggest it, but join warner on any climb omg he is a leader beyond leaders experienced compassionate uh, your biggest cheerleader, he's looking out after you, you know, he's got eyes all around his head, he, he knows where everybody is, how everybody, look at, look at him describing his son, his, his, his foot was someplace and his body was six inches. Now, who, who notices that stuff but beside an expert and a leader? And that's what Werner, Berner, Werner Berger is, and I couldn't recommend Werner more highly as a business leader, as an as a on-the-mountain leader, and, and in general, just a, just a great guy. So thanks, Werner. So, Werner, at 92, what do you want to be doing? Oh, become the oldest person to be on top of Mount Kilimanjaro. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you go. And I bet Deborah would be there with you. Thanks, everybody. Werner, again, thank you so much for being my guest. Thanks for listening to Stand Up and Speak Up. We are dedicated to encouraging you to remove the mask of embarrassment and being your best self. If you've been a victim of a scam or cybercrime, please visit against scams.org for assistance and guidance about options and recovery. SCARS, the Society of Citizens Against Relationship Scams, is an incorporated nonprofit crime victims assistance organization based in Miami, supporting scam victims worldwide. If you can, please make a small donation to help the victims around the world receive the help that they need. This episode has been sponsored by BenfoComplete.com, a vitamin supplement company that supports happy and healthy hands and feet for those with neuropathy. If you or anyone you know struggles with the pins and needles or numbness in their hands and feet, check out our Benfa teaming products at benfocomplete.com and use the special code STANDUP for 5% discount on your purchase. Again, thanks everybody for being here with us today. Go to my website, thewomanbehindthesmile.com, for additional information and resources. 
Check out my YouTube channel and subscribe and follow the replays of all of our great guests. Have a great day, everyone. Thanks very much for being here.